Yo, what is good, everybody? Welcome back to another video. Hopefully, you guys are having an awesome day full of only positive vibes. Guys, yesterday I said I would drop a SPR video today, and today is that day. We did, did two days of testing, so you'll see the footage is compiled between both of them. But we did manage to give you guys kind of more or less... Uh, analysis like unofficially obviously this is not official and obviously when it comes to the test servers can be a little bit different uh so yeah this is all gonna be from my live stream trouble the live slash the hitman as well as youtube.com slash the hitman line first pinned comment so if you guys want to make check out check it out make sure to watch until the end of the video there's some pretty cool um information here all right see you guys at the end oh spr okay okay we have the spr okay cool we have the spr as well so let's check out what's in the xpr i have not checked this out yet I know the SPR is available, so that's just one thing that I, I do want to check out. The SPR. Okay. It, oh, I'm excited. Okay. Muzzles, probably just the same old, same old. Yeah. Oh, it has an RTC compensator. That could be very important. RTC compensator, it says surprise. That, that's, I don't think we've seen something like this. Something with 18 vertical recoil and horizontal. The downsides are really not that much. The barrel, we have the RTC light. RTC light, heavy barrel, monolithic silence barrel. So could be a vibe, could be a vibe. Optics, you can have the sniper. So obviously you can make this like a sniper or you can make it like a marksman. So vibing with that. We have the stocks, skeleton stock, steady stock. Okay. Um, I don't know what the, the oh, plus 25 aiming crosshair drift. That's interesting. That's interesting. That's interesting. Laser sight. I think you're going to attach that no matter what. Under barrel. Just a regular same old, same old. Ammunition. Okay. This is important. We have the regular extended mag, the 10 rack extended mag. This one does give um, a little bit more body damage multiplier. And then we have this one too, which gives more damage, but not the multiplier. So I'm curious to see what's the difference. Oh, there's bolts. Oh, I didn't notice that. Oh. Oh, I, okay, okay, <laughs> okay. I want to see how the diamond looks on this. That's clean. But Damascus, was that the same as the other update? If it's shiny in game too, because you can tell that by the glare, it's not like a, one uniform glare. Yeah, it's much better. The gold also got a slight update. I don't know if you guys noticed. It's almost like... Kinda like sandy kind of vibe. A little bit. The diamond is no longer the pink one, thank God. All right. Important to know if it like. Okay, so leg shots are seventy-two. Base ammo is going to be five, so that's that's basically sniper. Arm shot is gonna be okay. Hand shots a hundred, so that's that's pretty neat. Head shot is going to be a hundred forty-four, so. Yeah, COD Mobile News Channel. That's where you would get it. The Iron Sights. Yeah, I kind of like it. I like the Iron Sight. Wait, am I missing? Okay, 100 to the hands. Okay. Up to up to what, what meter? 98. Oof. It feels like an outlaw right now. But the bolt action. Like, yes, you can hit one tap pretty far, but like, if you hit the hands, you're kind of screwed. It does drop off a little bit more at the, what is that, 40 meter plus. Uh, now, we're going to use the attachments. Um, I don't remember exactly what attachment is what. I believe this is just a regular build that I would have typically used. So, there's no, there's no range boost on this. However, I think we have like a... Uh, if we change this, we have a different magazine. So this magazine is supposed to increase the damage. Oh. Oh. Oh my god. 40 meters hand damage? That's that's sick. That's pretty good. I feel like I have the same mag. Okay. So this might be the damage one. No, there's the same damage. For me, the important part is which one is the one that makes it more consistent at long range. 
Oh, the other barrel is definitely better. We're gonna double check to see which barrel is which. 98 to the hand. We're switching to this one. Hands is 100, 100 damage at this range too. What build is this? It actually could be a vibe. Okay, so number four uses which magazine? It should be the five round mag. Yeah, okay, so that's definitely better. The body part multiplier does. I don't feel like it's worth it. Just increase the damage is way better. Uh, this one has the light bolt on it to increase the fire rate. But I don't think you need the bolts. I'm going to be real. I don't think the bolts are required. All right. So we're going to compare to our base locus. We're doing the 40 meter range because I, I feel like. Okay. So 95, 95, 95, 142. You can kind of tell that's without stopping power. Almost like right here, right below this button. Okay. So we kind of have that going on. Then we have the uh, DLQ base. So you can see a little above that 135, 135 again. Stomach area 135. Still 135. Almost to the pelvis area. Yeah. So almost like the pelvis area. So 135 is the hitbox. Now we have the stopping power locus. To almost about the same, I feel, as the DOQ, right? Slightly lower, slightly higher. Okay. And then, but remember this. The SBR has a, a, a very fast ADS speed. Like, very fast. And it's one, it one taps. It actually has better lethal zones. Uh... Huh. Okay, but it's important to note that this is 20 meters. It's really relevant in the 40 meter mark because this actually has a range to it. Okay, yeah, yeah, okay, that makes sense. Whew. But still, at last, it's still, um, it's still really good. What about the hands? It's still 100 at the hands. So, Slightly worse hit 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 boxes at the 40 meter mark, but the ADS speed is really fast. So I think it's a, it is de definitely a strictly better outlaw. Okay, the ADS, like the ADS speed is still really fast. So we'll see if it's worth. Okay, there's always people that push this way. Where's the enemies? Hello? Hello? Yo, that sounds good, man. It does feel a little bit better. Let's let's see how the rate of fire is. Okay, I'm gonna try out the rate of fire. Okay. One, two, three. It's about the same. Ten percent doesn't really change much, right? One, two, three. Yeah, it's about it's about the same. I don't actually have a real timer, so I'm not really timing it, but it didn't shoot there. I think that was the rate of fire. I couldn't tell if that race of rate of fire or fat finger. I couldn't tell if that was rate of fire or fat finger. It's cause like you can't shoot. Hold on, I'll tell. It's like a weird thing. See, it's like a, okay, one. You can't shoot exactly when the thing is done reloading. There's like there's like a half a second before you can shoot after the. So I don't know if that's a glitch or not because like, like half a second after you shoot. First half nuke chat. Yeah, I mean, I don't. I think it was rate of fire, cause here I'll show it to you guys.
Because if you... Look, watch. Reload, reload, reload. Reload, reload, reload. Reload. You know what I'm saying? Maybe... I think that was Fat Finger, because I definitely had enough time in between. It's got really good lethal zones. Quick scopes feels nice though. I'm not gonna cap. The quick scopes feel so nice. Quick scopes feel nice though. Oh, that was bad. Yeah, the quick scope feels nice. I didn't shoot there. Yeah, I think that was a rate of fire thing. See, you can still hear the noise. Even though he's done the, the animation. I'll use a nuke this time, chat. See, like, in that situation, I should have been able to hit him. All right, we're using nuke. Nuke the bots. We're nuke the bots. I, yeah, I don't think the um, the thing helps. I really don't think that helps. I'd much rather have faster ADS speed. Because it just feels the same. You, you have to remember. Hey, Carol. How you doing? Three more for nuke. I'm not going to get the double. Because I, I didn't refresh. I didn't re, re, uh, change the... Wait, that hit marker? Can you give me one more? Yeah, I think that sniper was good. I think I think you kind of have to like from 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 testing and what I found, like obviously from yesterday too, we were testing this. Um, if if it stays like this, you can go for ADS build, but the the biggest biggest drawback it's about two to three seconds in between shots. In comparison to other snipers, it's pretty, uh, but the, 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 the hitboxes and the uh, lethal zones are, uh, pretty nice. And the ADS speed is pretty good. If you want to use it as a marksman, you can though. Like it's, it's really not that big of a deal if you use it as like a marksman. Uh, so like, for example, like we take off this and then we put like, we just have the light barrel. But like, what can, yeah, like you can try this build here, right? Instead of the extended, you put the, you can potentially use this. It should be able to still one tap. ADS is pretty fast. I'm curious to see how it would feel. Do I have the full ADS speed? I do. It doesn't feel that fast. I guess sniper scope is different, right? I don't know how satisfied this is. Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. Can I put a red dot on this? That'd be kind of cool. Let's put a red dot on it. Would it just use a red dot? Kind of, kind of a vibe. It's kind of a vibe. All right. All right. It's kind of a vibe. I'm not going to lie. Kind of a vibe. Let's hit these quick scopes. I hit marker there. That kind of sucked. Is there a s enemies? It's kind of a vibe. Kind of a vibe. Not gonna lie. It's like kind of cool. I don't know how great it is though. Okay. I I missed. Again, the, the the rate of fire is still pretty poop. It's like a better kilo boat. Huh. 
The lethal zones are pretty good on this. Bro, I'm fat fingering the slide button. Come on, dude. I gotta put this jump button, the slide button, a little bit bigger. Hello? Oh my god, it takes forever. Getting shot in the back? Oh, I'm trying to like hip fire. I feel like this build could be a vibe for like close range. Obviously, you're not gonna hit long range. I'm curious to see how this would feel like on a long range. I feel like the irons like don't see too well on long range maps. All right, that's it for today. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you like, share, and subscribe. Don't forget to let me know in the comments down below what you guys think about the SPR. Honestly, I think it's a really fun gun, especially if you can do like a regular marksman build. Seems to be pretty good. And also, if the rate of fire is slightly better, this could be a game-changing gun. But let me know what you guys think. All right, I'm out. See you guys next time. Kill it.